What's up everyone? It's Sydney and this is your 40 minute strength and conditioning workout. So grab your dumbbells and your jump rope and let's get started. What's up everyone? I'm so excited that you're here today for our first workout of the week. This is a strength and conditioning workout. One of my favorite styles. We have a strength move in a superset fashion with a cardio or conditioning move. I'm gonna give you every single cardio move, low impact options as well. So if you don't have, for instance, a jump rope or something like high knees is uncomfortable to you, I'll show you what to do to make it work for you. So grab your water bottle and your sweat towel and your jump rope, like I said, if you have it. For the dumbbells today, the lightest exercise that I'm gonna be doing will be a front raise in a lunge. So I'll use my 10 pound dumbbells for those all the way up to something like a squat and press where I'll push up into my 25, potentially 30 pound dumbbells. We're gonna be working for 30 seconds and resting for 15, three rounds through each superset, okay? So thumbs up if you are ready, let's jump right into the warm up. We're gonna inchworm it out in three, two, one, let's go. Walk it out plank and then walk it back to your toes and let's just keep this moving for four reps good two more good last one I want you to stay out there in your plank position good job flex the core flex the glutes the quads and step up outside with your left leg and take it back come outside with your right leg Good, back and switch. Let's do three more per side here. Sinking your hips down, switch. And opening your chest up. Good, switch. And switch. Good, last one each side. Step it up, open the arm up. And take it back, switch. Open the arm up. Great job, stay here. You're gonna take your hips up in the air, straight legs. Great job, walk it into the middle. Both legs are straight still. Hang here. And walk it over to the right side, straight legs. Hamstring stretches. Great work. Come back into the middle for me, both toes point forward, bend and straighten. Let's hit a little inner thigh work. Good job, get your mind right for this workout today. You showed up for a reason. You're committed, you're dedicated, you know this is gonna make you feel better. Keep that in mind as you rock through this workout. Slowly come on up. And let's bring your feet in a little closer, drop it down to a squat. Open your legs outward. And stand up. Good, back down. And up. Two more squats. Good. Last one. There we go, come on up, heels to glutes. Now the whole mindset of this workout is you're strong, you're gonna get your heart rate up at the same time. So, dual benefits here. Okay, a couple different ways for you to appreciate your strength is what I hope. Good job. Stop here, arms cross. Great work, a little side step. So we start to integrate movement in the whole body. Good, four, three, two, one. Stop in the middle, big circles back. Good. And let's bring it forward, over, over. Good work. Nice, come in the middle right here, step and tap. Good, get your body moving side to side. Good, stop in the middle, bring your knee up to opposite elbow. Great work. And now let's cross right here, twist, twist. So in 30 seconds, we're gonna get started. I love a nice long warm up for your strength and conditioning for you. We've gotta add a little bit more to the workout strength and conditioning that we did two weeks ago. So you'll feel a little more spice. Curl, press, and turn as you exercise one. Curl, press, turn. Curl, press, 
turn, okay? So you're dropping into the squat, curl and press, and then turn as you're pressing. Let's go in three, two, one, come on. Good. Curl, up, turn and press. Fifteen more seconds, good job. Starting off with a pretty powerful, dynamic full body move. Four, three, two, one, and drop those dumbbells down out of your way. We're gonna go high knee claps sideways. Okay, we'll go in seven seconds. So jog in place if you're ready. Four, three, two, one, right here, come on. Great work. Fifteen. There we go. Seven, good. Six. Four. Three, two, one. And we're back to the top. Round number two, if you need to go up and wait, let's go. Four, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Sit, push. There you go. You keep control here. 15. Come on, keep moving. Strong, strong bodies. Eight, seven. Last one, three, two, one. Good, always finish the rep that you're on. And lateral skips are back. Taking the clap out, this time you're just here. Okay? We'll switch it up each time to kind of give you some good variety. Three, two, one, let's go. Up, up. There we go. And 15 seconds out of knee tap. Here, here, here. Keep going. Six, five, two, one. Last round. Let's go. Whew. Heart rate should be getting up. Should be feeling your legs wake up. Let's go. Five. Last round, challenge yourself. Three, two, one, big push. There we go. Fifteen more seconds. Keep those shoulders strong through the press. Six, five, Yes, let's go. Three, two, one, rest. All right, let's finish it off. Lateral skips. We'll go 10 seconds here, here, and here. Ready? Three, starting here. Two, one, let's go. Good job. All right, bring the arms here. Let's go. Keep the core tight. There you go, tap that knee. Two, one, let's go. Two, one, and rest. First superset done. Go ahead and grab some water. We're gonna move on to what I was telling you about in the beginning of the workout, the lighter exercise for our dumbbells. We've got lateral lunge, front raise. So last week, we did a raise at the bottom, here, up and down, come back up and switch. This time, we're gonna raise, push, pull, lower, okay? So there's a split second more work for your shoulders in that squat, or in that lunge. 
okay? We'll go in eight seconds, looks like this. Okay, three, two, one, alternate sides, keep moving. Good, so you're sitting in the lunge just a second longer. Go up, in and out, down. There you go. 15. Beautiful work. Five, two, one, and rest. Next one, you have mountain climbers. Standing or on the ground. I'm gonna let you pick. If you're standing, you're here. If you're on the floor, you're here. Okay, let's go. Two, one, mountain climbers. Here we go. Whichever one you choose, it's getting the knees up right under the ribs and hips. If you're standing, adding a little more with your arm punch. Great work. 10 more seconds, come on. I'm with you, four, three, two, one, rest. All right, now we lunge just to the right, okay? So you're gonna go here, in and out, up, down, in and out. Okay, so just to the right. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Good. Spend lots of time sitting. And if you can't get the lunge, you can also just go squat, right? Here, okay? Let's go, seven. Think about this as just a single leg squat. Two, one, rest. Great job. That's all lateral lunges. One leg squats, the other leg's just out of the way. Mountain climbers, round two, let's get it. Breathe, three, two, one, we're off. Good, move and breathe. 15 seconds, turn it up a little more. And you know what's coming for this last round. Okay, the other side. Sprint for five, three, and rest. Great job. All right, now we take it to the left. Stay out here, okay? Just think about sitting. Squat, stand. Squat, stand, okay? Three, two, one. Let's go. Last round right here. Keep your knee outward. Keep your core tight. And as you push your knee kind of outward, you should feel your glute activate. 15. Try to get back into that lunge. Sit, sit, sit. Come on, push the whole foot down. Four, two, one, rest. Good. And now, final round of mountain climbers. You're doing great. Come on, breathe deep. Here we go. Four, three, two, one, 30 second sprint. Go. Yes, good job. Check in with your core. Make sure you're not butt in the air, belly reach down. Pull it in, neutral. Knees are climbing. Good job, let's go, 10. A little quicker for five. Three, two, one, breathe. Great job, we're moving right along. Grab some water. You've got sumo squat and a bicep curl. We're adding a little heel lift to the sumo squat this time. All right, so two dumbbells in your hands right here. You're gonna go down, curl, lift, and up. Extra challenge, stay down in the squat. Here, up, here, 
up, okay? I'm gonna try to go there, but if you need a break, stand up after every curl. Ready, let's go. Three, two, one, come on. Curl, calf raise. If you need to stand, you stand. Nice proud chest here, lift. Your quads are gonna start to feel it really well. Focus on your biceps when the legs start to burn. Six, five. Two, one, great job. Throw those dumbbells down. Toe taps now. Okay, you can tap on the dumbbell or you can just tap here, okay? Spice it up with a little punch right here. Three, two, one, let's go. Good, 15. Focus, breathe. Seven. Three, two, one, breathe. Oh, that's a tough combo. Great job. Same thing, same exact moves. Two more rounds. <sighs> Big deep breath with me, here you go. Four, three, squat curl. Two, one, let's go. Fourteen, you're doing great. If you're standing or if you're staying seated, focus on the legs and the biceps. Six. Three, one more, come on, two. One, rest. Ah, big deep breath. I know the toe touches plus the arms. It's hard to breathe. So breathe now. There you go. If you need to slow it down, just kick. Two, one, let's go. Nice work. All right, 15 more seconds. Let's go. Breathe while you move. Rest. Great job. One more time through. And then we're rocking into the second half of the workout. Whew. Here we go. Three, two, one, you're strong. Come on, let's go. Yes, there we go. Your strength is what gets you through every day. Whether you stop to recognize it or not, I'm gonna let you recognize it right now. I'm gonna remind you of it right now. Your strength is what gets you through. Some days you feel stronger than others, you're always strong. Three, two, one, rest. Never forget that. Some days it feels like you're super strong. Some days it feels the opposite. Doesn't change the fact that you are strong, always. Three, two, finish this cardio out, let's go. Good, 15, come on. Keep moving, nine, eight, four, sprint, three, two, one. Breathe, great work. Okay, dumbbells out of the way. Breathe deep. I'm gonna grab some water. We've got a lunge and lateral raise. Probably your lighter dumbbells again, okay? Grab some water. Okay. It's always a good feeling when you're rocking into second half of the workout. You've just arched over the peak of the mountain. Now we just sprint to the end, okay? With good technique. 
Okay, we're going lunge, lateral raise. You can go reverse lunge here, okay? Or you can go forward here. Now in both of those cases, my raise is at the bottom. To modify either one of those, you do the lunge, come up, raise, okay? It's both arms together. So pick your poison, pick the way that you wanna move, whatever way challenges you. And we're going in three, two, one. Here we go, sit and a raise. Great job. Now each round, I'm gonna make this challenge optional, a little tougher for you. As for now, you're here, stay here. Six, three, two, one. Beautiful. Dumbbells out of the way. High knees down, butt kicks back. Okay, you're gonna go high knees lateral, butt kicks lateral. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Modification here. Good. Knees are up in front, and then heels are back to your butt. Yes, great job. Come on, four, three. And rest. Great job, you're back. Option to turn it up a little bit more. Add a little pulse, one, two, up. One, two, up. Ready? It's optional. Two, one, let's go. Good, straight hips. Make sure your hips aren't opening this way. Keep them straight. 10. And rest. Great job. All right, start down at the other end this time. High knees, butt kicks. There you go, breathe. That's what your rest is for. Two, one, let's go. There you go, you move your intensity. Good work, arms are working too. 15 seconds, don't just hold them. Don't cross them like this. They go like you're going into your pocket. Four, three, Two, one, rest. You got one last round. Whew. All right. Ready? Let's go. Four, three, two, one. Let's sit. Add that pulse if you can. Switch quicker. Good. Move your foot up and back. Spend more time down there. 15. Good job. Seven. Three, one more. Two. And rest. Ah. Great job. High knees and butt kicks. Let's go forward and backward this time. High knees down, butt kicks reverse. Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, move, move, move. 15 seconds, turn it up a little more. Five, finish here, four. Three, two, one, rest. Ah, <laughs> great job, grab water. Whew. The next one will give us a chance to slow it down just a bit. Tricep overhead extension is your strength. I'm gonna add a calf raise into that. So you're up and down, calf raise. Up and down, calf raise. 
After that, jump rope. All right, let's go. 15 seconds. This is where I'll use one of my heavier dumbbells for tricep overhead. Okay, we go in seven. If you can't get the overhead mobility reasons, give me the kickbacks. Two, one, let's go. Wherever you decide to do the calf raise is fine. Just make sure you're stable. Relax your shoulders so you shouldn't be shrugging. Good, let that sweat fall. You've earned it. Six. Two, one, good. Jump rope or high knees or mountain climbers or jog or sprint to your mailbox, run up your stairs. Okay, if you don't have a rope, you can mimic the same motion without a rope with some towels, okay? Two, one, let's go. Whatever you're doing, just move here with a good intensity. Fifteen seconds, good. Five, four, two, one, rest. Great work, we're back to triceps. Like I said, make sure you can get your bicep beside your ear comfortably. If you're here, might be why your shoulders and neck are bothering you. Overhead extension. Three, two, one, let's go. And I will, as you can see, lean my head out of the way just a bit, okay? But if you're here, and this is as far as you can get, you're gonna have to maneuver kind of weird like this. So work on that mobility in the meantime, do some kickbacks. Still getting the triceps. Six. Three. Two. Great job, rest. All right, I'm gonna go up on my last round. But as for now, we jump rope, or your choice of cardio. The cordless ropes, also a great option. I always link them in the description. Three, two, one, let's go. If you're someone who doesn't have the ceiling clearance or you can't be banging on the floor when you work out, cordless ropes, same exact motion. They just don't slap the floor. Okay, you still swing them in that circle motion. You're still moving like this. Here we got 10 seconds, let's sprint. Four, three, two, one. All right, last round, let's get it. This is a good one to kind of catch your breath, right? Focus on the strength here. Four, let's go up, three, two, one. Come on. Good work, 15. Five, four, two, one. Beautiful work. Oh. Okay, let's go, hop it out, sprint it out, whatever you got. Whew. You're doing amazing, let's go, three, Two, one, come on. Good, 15 seconds, go, go. Nine. Five. Three, two, one, and rest. Oh, beautiful job. Whew. Big deep breath. All right, last big circuit here. Let's have a little fun, okay? 
I know you're like, I don't know if I trust you with the word fun, Sydney, but let's switch it up a little bit. I'll be fair and say that. We're gonna do the bent row and the kickback that we did last week or two weeks ago, okay? So you're rowing with the left hand, you're kicking back with the right foot, okay? So think of yourself as a box. Knees and hands form a box, the opposite corners lift, okay? When you do, get done with that, stand up for jumping jack high knees. Then you're gonna flip it over. Chest press, glute bridge, okay? We're adding this one in, combo style. Both hips and dumbbells go up together. To modify, go here, down, rest your elbows, and bridge. Or just take the bridge out of it, okay? Burpees for your cardio there. So let's go in 10 seconds. I'm gonna start with my 15s on the row and kick back. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Think of your glutes and your back here. Everything posterior is flexing. Control it all. The opposite corners of your box up here. Press into the floor as the other one lifts off. Beautiful work. You got 10. Three, two, one. 15 seconds. Come on up. We've got jump ropes. I mean, uh, jumping jacks, sorry. And we're gonna rotate semi-circle. Here, here. Here, here, okay? Or just stay in the middle, jumping jacks. Three, two, one, let's go. Clap, clap. And be thinking about the weight you wanna use for chest press, okay? Good job, 15 seconds. Nine, eight. Three, two, one. I'm gonna go 25s for chest press. Ready? Heels down, elbows out 45 degrees. Three, two, one, let's press. Here you go, 15 more seconds. Good work, focus on that upper body. Four, three, two, one. Good work. All right, move those dumbbells out of the way. Flip over for burpees, okay? You can step back and step up, win if you need to. Ready? Here we go, four, three, two, one. Up, back, up. Breathe at the top. Fifteen. There you go, five seconds. Can you give me one more full one? Three, two, one, and rest. Towel it off, you're back to row and kick back. And that's what we got for two more rounds. That's your workout. That's the end of it, okay? I need you to keep going hard. Here we go, glute squeeze. And let's go. Focus on the spot right between your thumbs. Good, this is your chance to slow it down. Strength is where you breathe and muscle focus. Five, three, two, one, and rest, good. Now breathe deep, this 15 seconds is not about getting up, complaining, oh my gosh, we have this left. It's just about your recovery. I could push you right into the next one. Breathe. Ready, let's go. That's how I make sure that your next work period is as good as it can be. You don't complain in the rest. You breathe. Great work, 15 more seconds, and then you're headed back to 
chest press glute bridge. You are doing amazing. Three, two, one. Yes, good. Come on down. Glute bridge, chest press. I like to put them on my thighs here and then kick it up to myself to lay down. Two, one, let's go. I've had that question before, that's why I show you. Use your legs. Good. Good, last 10 seconds, right here. Seven. Are you breathing? Two, one, good. All right, burpees, let's go. Flip it over, and then we've got one more round through everything, and that's it. No surprises, okay, that's a promise. <laughs> let's go. Three, two, one, come on. Back, up, and up. Now if you're stepping, get your feet wide before you come up, and then reach, okay? That's totally fine, by the way. We're moving together. I need you to challenge yourself. If that looks like a push up and a tuck jump, go. If that looks like step back, step up and stand, go. We're in it together. Five, three, two, one. Stay here, breathe. This is it, last round. Row and squeeze that glute. Here we go. Three, two, one. Come on, exhale and lift. You hear me breathing, that needs you to do the same. 10 seconds. Back muscles strong, four. Three, two, one, rest. Come on up, jumping jacks. Woo! You're doing amazing. I'm so proud of you. Three moves to go. 30 seconds each, we got that. Three, two, one, let's go. Good. I know you can, I believe in you. I believe in the reason that you came here today. If it's for you, if it's for your environment, mental health, physical health, you deserve this feeling right here of the struggle. The struggle produces confidence in yourself. Two, one, chest press, let's go. As you watch yourself get through things, that's how you gain confidence in yourself and your abilities to overcome adversity, whatever that is. A chest press, a change. We're all moving and evolving together. Let's go. Come on, up, up, up. With the glutes, with the dumbbells, up. Nine, eight. Three, two, one, good. Dumbbells out of the way. Let's go. Best set of burpees ever. Right here. You ready? Come on, give it everything you've got because you deserve it. Come on, two, one, let's go. Good. 10 seconds in, find a little bit more. seconds to go find everything you've got show yourself right here come on three two one and breathe you have made it to your cool down amazing job whoa come down to your hands and knees fill your lungs up nice and wide big deep breath slow that breathing down 
Feel your lungs get wider. Don't shrug your shoulders, open your ribs up. Ah, there you go. All right, reach your hips back, arms forward. And come up, drop your hips down, open your chest up. Ah, big deep breath, I hope right now you can say, I gave it everything I had. That's what you come for. What you have each day is all your effort. Maybe not your max dumbbell weights, maybe your max dumbbell weights. Maybe you felt super coordinated today. Maybe you showed up like, I don't know, I'm just gonna do what I can. Every day that's all we can do. And if you're here right now, you did that. You did that workout, you did it for yourself. Come on up, tuck your toes, push your heels back. You're trying to stretch your calves here. You can keep your head up, gaze looking forward. Continue to breathe. Walk back towards your feet, and as you walk back, bend your knees, drop into a deep squat. You deserve this feeling. You see that sweat on your mat? Feel your lungs expanding. <sighs> Push up to standing. This was for you. This was for your mental health. This was for your escape, your time, your strength. Okay, I wanna show you that you're strong. And at the same time, I wanna show you that you can push through hard things, like burpees with tuck jumps at the end, or like jump rope, whatever it was for you today, whatever your hardest circuit was, remember that, okay? Remember how hard it was for you and acknowledge the fact that you got through it, you overcame, okay? That's resilience, that is true strength. Being exposed to something and saying, hey, here's your trainer, Sydney, with a tough workout. You step up, you do it, you move on, okay? That's resilience, that's true strength. I didn't say the workout was perfect. I didn't say you never modified. I didn't say you never felt uncoordinated. I said you showed up, you were presented with a challenge, you accepted it, you did your best, and you move on. Okay, that's resilience and that's true strength. And I am so proud of you for showing yourself that today. It's not about showing me, it's about me showing up to allow you to show yourself, okay? So put your hand on your chest right here and say, I did that, and be proud of what you just did today. Go forward and do something else today and do the, I did that for yourself. Keep doing that, keep cheering yourself on. This is for you. Stay focused on what helps you, what brings you more joy, what brings you more strength. Stay in line with that, no matter what, okay? Keep the focus, keep the consistency, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. Before you head out, if you wouldn't care to do me a quick favor, give this video a thumbs up, share it with all your friends on all your social media channels, and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you back here tomorrow. I love you, proud of you.